Hello guys, welcome to another video I'm recording um, at my work site and this is why um, I'm using this face mask here we are not allowed to work without mask <coughs> okay so in today's video I will talk about five things you should know before come to Mozambique uh, as I said before um, I'm, I'm, I'm making this video just to let you know how is the life in here in Mozambique okay first thing I think that is going to uh, make and confuse your mind is the public transport you to have a public transport here uh, you need to go to the bus station with the 10 meter cash 10 meter cash I think in dollars should be let me calculate I will let me calculate here should be okay I won't see the exchange rate today is 64.6 64 so mm -hmm. oh then I, I I don't know if you can see the number but this is the 0 0.1265 uh, I think it less than one dollar to take a public bus this is the first thing you should have this money and you should fight to get in the bus because there is no order there is no ruler people fight to get in the bus there is no like a i, 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 I have the priority you you will see people fighting on the bus station to get the bus so uh, put into your in your mind that you will have to do it uh, you you should, should fight it's like confusing and wonderful but we are used to doing it so the second thing is um, I think is the communication we usually in the street we don't we don't greet the people like good morning, good afternoon, good good evening or good night. People, if you do it, people will look at you like a like a strangers. Because whenever you greet people to say good morning, good afternoon, it means that you want to ask for something, like to ask time, like to ask for duration, but. Out of it, there is no way. You people don't. They just walk in the street. They don't. They don't greet each other often. Yeah, and if you can, see, if you say like good morning, good afternoon, you will see that this person will stand. You will stand and wait for be asked something. Yeah. So that's what happened here. Okay. The. Okay, let, let's go to the tree. The tree is a um, um, cinema, cinema to watch a movie. Okay, maybe at the capital, the main city of Mozambique, which is Maputo, they have a cinema to watch movies. I don't know if it is the correct pronunciation. I say cinema, but almost the, all this, all the city, all the provinces here, they don't have a cinema. <laughs> So you you will have to watch your movie, your your new movie, in the computer. Okay, where we are ah we were talking about the sign um, I had to interrupt a little bit the the video because I was I was uh, talking to someone. So about cinema, forget about cinema. Oh, although this is a, a time of a coronavirus, uh, they, they I think in your countries they they don't allow to be crowded. So make you forget about cinema. Okay, let, let's go to the fall. Uh, to the fall, let me talk about uh, about uh, marriage. Yeah, this is worst. I think this is bad, and I think it's it's not only the in Mozambique. I think in most of the African countries it happens. 
they get married uh, when they're still younger when they, i think when they're still children because of the poverty their their father uh, prefer to to send them to the marriage they think that it is going to help to the family because they don't have it. they have they don't have the 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 money the economy to to support to give food the school so whenever comes a, a man to introduce himself to, to to the family they allow it easily they don't they, they don't complain so you, you will see here a lot of a uh, uh, children marriage um, yeah and it will make don't be like a don't, don't be shocked it's like uh, it's common here and the, the government the government is doing too much of a uh, effort in order to overcome these issues but uh, it's uh, I think it's a big big fight they will not uh, it will not pass now okay let's go to the five to end this video uh, to the five is about English <laughs> my friend uh, people here don't speak English <laughs> our official language is Portuguese it means that you, you will face a lot of problem with the communication. But there is something. Whenever you go to the hotel, hotel, you will find at least someone to speak English with. Whenever you go to the museum, you will find at least one someone to talk English with, like a guide, a guide. Uh, whenever you go to to supermarket, you will find the, uh, maybe the boss, the manager should speak English but people here don't speak English because we we English we 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 start studying English at the grade six you have, you have to start from grade one grade two three five only studying Portuguese and grade six you find English and will be finding it English it, it's just the uh, 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 I think 45 minutes per uh, uh, per a week to study English, and it's not. I think it's not enough to get fluent. So as you can see me, I I still facing some problem, but I think my English is is basically enough to get to make myself be understood. So uh, you will struggle with this with these issues of English here, but you'll find people like me who try to speak English wh whenever you go. Okay, uh, so I stop here. Don't forget to subscribe, comment below what you want to, to know about Mozambique, and see you in the next video. I love you guys. Be safe.